Hey guys, this is DJ Muffin, and we're back. <coughs> Sorry. And today, we I'm gonna show you um how to create your own YouTube channel and what I use and what I think you guys should use. Um, some are paid, some aren't. Basically, what I use is sometimes Screencastify. Um. And, um, don't, I wouldn't use if I were you guys, um, if I were you guys, I would get OBS, which is Open Broadcast, bro, yeah, OBS, um, just search it up, and, so, o Open Broadcast software is very good for YouTubers who want to record a bunch of things, they use a lot of things, it's pretty good, and um, the reason I don't use it is because my computer is not very good, I'm going to get a new one, where then I'll use OBS for not that much lag, um, so yeah, OBS is one of the best ones, I get OBS Classic, just for Windows 7, 8, and 10, if you have that, then it's the one to get, OBS Studio, is a different thing. It's a powerful API. So yeah, it's it's different, but I mean, <clears throat> yeah, it's free. So that's good for people who want free things. If you guys want something that can be free, but if you guys want it to be better, um, basically it's just you go to Bandy Cam, search that up. <coughs> basically, you go to bandycam.com. And it's game recording and screen recording. So if you just want to record your screen like this, or if you want to record like Minecraft, like I have right down here, um, then you can do that. Watch this video. It's free download. The full version is better. Um, I'm going to get that today probably. But I have the free download, which just says bandicam.com on the top of where you're recording, which is fine. But, I mean, I would rather have that. So you guys can just record your screen if you're playing like a Gario. And yeah, it's pretty cool. I know a lot of YouTubers use it. Um, it's pretty good. So yeah, that's that's the other one. If you guys want to know about editing, this one's a tough one because there's a lot of one. The Vegas, Sony Vegas Pro. Yeah, Sony Vegas Pro is very good, guys. That's one of the best editing. It's expensive. It's expensive, very expensive. So if you guys are like very good at YouTubing and you think, or you're just an expert at editing, then this has video auto, auto and Blu-ray. I mean, Vegas Pro is pretty good. Um, Vegas Pro is is one of the best video editor softwares out there. I'm using right now it's for beginners and intermediate people um my one of the uh, youtubers recommended me this so i got it and it's called filmora <clears throat> and there's also an editing app if you have ios and android you can go search filmora 60 and it is there so filmora 60 that's your if you want to edit your like phone videos or things, then that's the one to go. But it um, if you go to this one, it'll you can do free download or buy it. I mean, I would buy it unless um, it's not very good if you not if you don't buy it. So yeah, I'm going to buy it. But if you guys are just starting to get the free download, buy it now. I think it's forty bucks. For like, let me check real quick. It's like, yeah, for like a lifetime, it's fifty. For like multi uses, if you want to install on two to five, um, lifetime or a year, then you can change it. Um, right now, I'm gonna get the year license and thirty dollars per year. I want to see what it's like, and yeah. Um, if you guys are Mac users, um. I recommend using, just search up Mac editing software. These are mostly for Windows users. Um, if you guys want a Mac editing software, one of them is iMovie. It's pretty good for you guys, for like iMovie. You don't even, it already comes with it. It's pretty good. Um, 
But if you guys want a good one, it's a Final Cut Pro X. And that, it's a little bit better than iMovie. It's like intermediate and expert. So, yeah, um, that's that's what um, Final Cut Pro. And if you guys want Mac um, um, recording software, then um, I think... I think I don't remember, but it it um you guys figure that out for you so you guys know which one you feel comfortable with. I basically doing min Windows because I have a Windows computer. Um, so yeah, um, yeah, that's basically all we're gonna talk about. If you guys okay, no, no, that's not all. Um, intro maker. So if you guys are people have asked me, where do you make your intros? And one of the best ones that I've seen so far is called Clip. It's called Panzoid. Let's go to Panzoid.com. Let me just do that. Just Panzoid.com. And I'll show you guys the full steps because I know how to do this. Um, so basically, um, you have community templates. This is, I think someone used, um, did they use an intro? Probably. Oh, come on. Whatever. Um, basically, community templates. You can look at people's templates that they made. I usually get to just look at people who made these. Because um, you can just look at them and then play it and open it in Clip Maker. And you can, like, edit it. If you really like it, then you can edit it to put your name on it. If you guys want to see, like, how to make it, my friend Dr. Cash um has three three hundred fifty subs. Um he he did a thing for how to make those intros. So you guys go to his channel if you guys want to watch more. Um but what you do guys if you go to panzoid.com you'll first see this and so go to clip maker two and basically it'll edit you to clip maker thing. You can like choose your template there's a bunch of these. You can choose it. You can use like um, video resolutions, frame rates, lengths. I usually do it as, I think mine is at seven. Um, choose it scene. You can do outdoor blocks, darkness. Um, you can add objects. You can add effects. You can use a camera animation, position, rotation, shake, shake speed. You can use an audio file if you want. Um, it's pretty cool. You got frame buffer size. You got info. When you're ready, just start video render and like let's play it. That's that's all. And then you can yeah, that's basically most things I'll talk about today. And hopefully you guys learned some things of how to record. Um, what things you could use to do your intro recording, editing. Um, hopefully I helped you guys. Um, please leave a like if you guys want to see more tutorials on how to do um, things in recording or other um, tutorials on things. Um, hopefully you guys liked it. Hopefully I gave you some advice. Um, so basically, that's all today. I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye!